trip. Well, uh, we're in the birches, trying to look at some of these uh, mountain birds. Uh, got, got friends out here with some property we can camp on. And Jeep following us. We've got four days off, so we're gonna go see if we can drum up. Uh -huh. No pun intended, drum up. Right. It's beautiful out here. It is. The leaves are all bursting with green and pretty big mountains and hills. Get a good workout if anything else. We'll see what happens. Stay tuned. We're at our destination. Curious why there's water pouring out of the side of the camper, but huh, what do I know? Cat must not be too tight. Huh, interesting. This is Daryl's property. So he so graciously has invited us to come and stay so we can, uh, Hunt in the Berkshires. We'll be here until Saturday. I think it's Wednesday. So we got a couple days to check stuff out and find the birds. Yeah. I'll I'm probably going to go right up there to your lot on Orphan Road and just sit there and see if you hear anything. Last ha half hour and listen. Yeah. Is yep. there something to go on the roost? Yep. This is and all. It, and if I hear something, we'll go work on that first thing in the morning. But then I'd like, I'd go down to a place like this that's a dead end. It's got an old woods road that, that goes for a long ways in. You just go park and walk in and every 150 yards just yep. this give, a, is give a blind yelp and see if we get an answer. This is a good candidate for that because this road stops here, but then it goes on all the right. way through to the next stop. Uh, and road. then if if uh, you know if, if nothing happened here and I still had a couple hours of the other day, I'd leave here and go up to oh that big piece that's up behind Sparky's, and I've just been looking at the you know, oh yeah yeah the maps. Yeah. That, that's a big yes, wildlife huge, management huge. area. That's in, that's that's got roads and whatnot that go out in it that. What time is it? Uh, 4.45, morning late. Morning late. Well, it's not like we roosted any turkeys last night. So we're going to have to stock and drop them, right? I'm going to have to do something. Beautiful. The landscape is perfect. 
We did have it see a deer. Yeah. That's about all we saw. Oh, look at the windmills over there up on the top of the mountains. Huh. But the turkeys have got luck, Josh. They got something. Uh, maybe they just don't got turkeys. Maybe. We did see two hens. Two hens this morning? Yep. If I was a turkey, I would live here. I would absolutely live here. There's no people hunting. And there's miles and miles and acres and acres of beautiful landscape. All right, what time is it about? Oh, seven, nine? seven o'clock. All right. Just ran into Sparky. He filled us in on a little intel, but not a lot of it was encouraging, but we <laughs> do appreciate it. It was good to see it. Huh? We'll probably catch up. No, no, we're going to go to his house. Yeah. We're going to catch up with him later. Yeah. All right. Us. All right, we're out. We gotta get focused here. We're gonna go. See ya. Day two morning, I should say, of hunting in the Berkshires. Not so much luck. These birds are hard to even locate. We've seen some hens. We've not seen one Tom or one Jake. We walked about six miles yesterday in the woods and saw bears and deers and I don't know, birds and stuff, but not the right kind of birds. <laughs> so uh, let's see what happens today. Couldn't roost anything again last night, so we're just gonna kinda go to some areas that some people told us about and see what we can do. Right, Hen? What? Yes. We're just gonna go try to find some birds today. Yeah. Waiting on coffee right now. It's almost ready. Have to make it happen. We shall see.
Wow. Will you read it? Will you read it? This tablet erected in the memory of the following men who gave their lives here in a plane crash, August 15th, 1942, while in service of their country. Look at the pieces on top, huh? Mm. People must find stuff and then just buy it. Yeah. Belt buckle. Wow. A little bit of a hike, but it's kind of cool actually finding it, huh? A lot of a hike. Uh, told you not to step on them. I feel like you're going to be reading the onyx from the rest of the day. As we undressed and stripped down to cooler clothes, he dropped his glasses and I said, Oh, your glasses, don't step on them. And he looked and saw him. Five minutes later, he stepped on them. Oh, you get the lines in. Oh, if I get a popsicle stick, I'd be awesome. Well, if you can keep them in your hand. They're heavy. <laughs> heavy glasses. Wow. The woods, the fields, the hills, everything's here, except the turkeys. We've walked probably, I don't know, a total of 15 or more miles on this trip, and uh, we've seen a few hens. I've not heard a gobble. I've not seen a male turkey. We're baffled in the Berkshires. Baffled in the Berkshires. Yes, I like that. Yeah. We're out for one last try this morning, Saturday, May 15th. So you at least got to try a little bit this morning and see if we can do anything, but it's our second stop. We're just listening. He's calling. I mean, we're out in the middle of nowhere. Uh, the locals said they've seen them before the season. Apparently no one hunts this area. Not too many people. So well, they're not already hunted. So uh, uh, 
no one's seeing him. It's not just us. I mean, we suck, apparently, but apparently people around here do, too, because no one's seeing him. So these birds are either hiding in caves or uh, got tunnels underground. I can't, I can't imagine. It's the life of me. Never would have thought it would have been this hard out here. But it's been a good, it's been a good trip. I mean, we're having fun. Met up with some friends. Got to camp in the camper. And uh, we'll head home this afternoon. And I don't know, we're gonna have to go out Monday morning and kill another turkey, cause I know they're at home. They're in my friggin' yard. We just wanted a different challenge, but man, yeah, we've had a challenge. All right. Let's see what happens. What do you see, hen? I see five hens over there in the bushes. Two sites over from where we've been staying. Hang on, I'm gonna get them off the back window. No, that's a Jake. Yeah? Are they all Jakes? I saw a beard. I see two little beards. There's more than five. One, oh. two, three, four, five, there's six. There? Yeah, there's two Jakes there. They're gonna cross the road. Hang on. They're crossing the road? Yep. Been here for three days. Have only seen hens. We are leaving to go home. And these jokers. One, two, three hens and three jakes just crossed the road. Literally went right around us in the camper. Unbelievable. Baffled in the Berkshires. Out. We just spent the last four days in the Berkshires. Got home. It's 12.15. Hunting stops for turkey at noon. This is what's in our backyard. <laughs>